All right, so I'm here with Eric, one of the writers on Portal 2. And uh, is there anything you can tell me about this game that separates this game from the last game? How is this experience going to be enhanced? Well, the biggest difference uh, between Portal 1 and Portal 2 is the co-op experience. We've included uh, a full co-op uh, track, which is for two players, four sets of port or four portals, two sets of portals, and uh, it's about twice as long. The co-op track by itself is about twice as long as the first portal. And this, and the uh, single player track is single player track. There's obviously still a single player campaign that is also about twice as long as Portal, but they're two separate tracks. There's no uh, different story, different puzzles, uh, completely different sets of uh, puzzles. All right, so effectively, it's about four times longer than the first Portal. Yeah, about four times as long. The, um, how is uh, Have you listened to fan feedback? Is there anything that people said, like, hey, I'd like to see this in Portal 2, that you guys were like, hey, I think that'd be good too? Well, the biggest thing uh, it goes back to co-op again. We heard from lots and lots of people that they somehow managed to play Portal 1 cooperatively. It was just a game where it was almost like a, a kind of gateway drug for pe people who played games would kind of rope their friends in who didn't play games or their boyfriend, girlfriend, parents, whatever, and they would sort of sit together and actually play it with the gamer manning the control and uh, we just wanted to get a controller into that second person's hand and let them you know, share in the experience more fully. So hopefully your friend actually has a brain too. Um, when can we expect this game to be released? It'll be out uh, February 9th, 2011 on PC, Mac, Xbox 360, and the PS3. Covering the whole board. Yep. All right, man, thanks a lot for your time. I really appreciate it. No